In a strange scene, a mysterious cube of light and a swarm of mysterious light balls, and what looks like a gate, were seen in the sky during stormy weather, and summer clouds in the sky of Phoenix, Arizona. In a related context, the sightings of unidentified flying objects, mysterious phenomena and unexpected weather changes, continued in many countries of the world. Where a strange cube of light was seen hanging from the clouds in the sky of Phoenix, followed by the appearance of a swarm of mysterious light balls circling in the sky. It was 7 in the evening and there was a summer rainstorm clouds forming in the sky. In Sheboygan, Michigan. An unknown rectangular flying object was seen in the sky, flying in a straight line very slow. It was very white after it passed through the tree, it took off straight into the sky. In Rochester, Minnesota, United States, two flying objects appear to be interacting in airspace. The mysterious cube of light was slowly flying the sky, and then something like a flying saucer was noticed shining, with the same light inside the mysterious cube. Soon, the mysterious cube disappeared, and the flying saucer inside also disappeared, and more mysterious light balls continued to appear flying in the sky. The motion of these objects seemed to be deliberately coordinating with each other, as they soared toward the sky and out of sight. It was also very bright compared to other objects in the evening sky, and could be seen shining through the dark clouds. Some seemed to start flashing red and other colors. The location was very close to the Phoenix airport. These objects seemed to be moving into the clouds above the airport. These things seemed too big, too fast, and too bright to be balloons, and too close to the airport. It was also interesting that it happened just before a rainy sandstorm, which usually has large amounts of lightning. A mysterious light remained in the place where the cube disappeared, like a gate in the sky. We have all seen in Hollywood movies different tales, about the existence of time portals and holes, through which one can travel through the universe, but we were all convinced that, it was just a fiction of the writer's imagination. Could this fantasy be real? In fact, one of the researchers in mysterious phenomena and unidentified flying objects told me that, there is a lot of what we see in science fiction films, that have an origin in reality. And the writer has derived the idea, from a personal experience he went through, or information he has reached, or even eyewitness accounts from friends, and evidence moreover, there are many films, in which it is explicitly stated that they are derived from real events. In this strange scene, you feel that you are actually watching a Hollywood movie. So did the mysterious cube of light in the sky act as a gateway, and that these unidentified flying objects had traveled through it, or were we just fantasizing about it? In Sheboygan, Michigan. An unknown rectangular flying object was seen in the sky, flying in a straight line very slow. It was very white after it passed through the tree, it took off straight into the sky. At first there was no metallic object, just a bright white light flying low, but when the flying object rose in the sky, began to appear a material object in the form of a rectangle, and there is in the middle something like a thrust engine, that pushes it directly towards the sky so that, there is a white exhaust, that is clear in the footage that may be the result of the thrust engine. We all know the ability of these unknown flying objects, to transform into the plasma state immediately, before they fly away into space, but this case is different from what we are accustomed to seeing. The flying object changed to the plasma state while flying at a low altitude. It turned again to the physical state while rising in the sky, 
and a square material object appeared, followed by what looked like exhaust from the engine. And as an explanation for this. When searching in the history of classic mysterious flying objects, you find many cases that talked about eyewitnesses and researchers in UFOs, have reported the existence of some of these mysterious objects, that contain thrust engines, that they use while they are in the atmosphere to overcome gravity, but after they leave the Earth's gravitational field, these engines are not used. But these flying objects were seen, in the 70s of the century. Is this unidentified flying object old-fashioned? In Rochester, Minnesota, United States, two flying objects appear to be intacting in airspace. At 4.05 am what appeared to be a green cylinder was seen, flying and interacting with what appeared to be a white light, or what was thought to be a star, suddenly began to slide around the sky, rapidly changing altitude and direction. The green cylinder seemed to deal with this white orb, which subsequently changed its shape and color from white, to pulsating light of different colors. At some point, the green cylinder also changed and appeared as a triangular vehicle consisting of three connected orbs, pulsing with all colors, blue, red and green, in a strange sight. We have all heard about the mysterious triangular vehicles, that have been seen in many places around the world, and some have confirmed that, they are secret man-made military vehicles, that run on special engines that use nuclear accelerated mercury, which enables the vehicle to completely cancel the force of gravity, and make it float in the sky, but no one spoke of who accepted that, there are human-made objects, that can transform from a plasma state to a physical state. 